Swap display? Oh, yeah, zoom in. Of course. Why, why, why put the dialogue or the letters, why have it spell out zoom or zoom in when you can have it say swap display instead, which is absolutely synonymous with what's happening right here. Yeah, definitely. Queen. What else? Hubert is the heir of Marquis Vestra. He has served me since I was a child. You may think his blood runs a bit cold, but... Are you actually going through to all of the characters? Accurate. Why would I not? Still, if you can oh, okay. pass that, you'll see he's quite astute and reasonable. Can, can, can you name an eviler looking man? Honestly. For some reason, he thinks of me as a bitter rival and is always trying to challenge me. It's terribly irritating. His house is that of Duke Iyer, which produces Adrestia's prime ministers. That family is... perhaps too pleased with its own status. I'm sorry, Edelgard, I need you to refer to him by his full name. Ferdinand von Eyer. Iger. Right. I never remember if the G is pronounced or not. Alright, we the won't G go through all Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. We won't go through every single character. However, I gotta go through Best Girl. Few commoners have joined the Black Eagle House. But Dorothea oh, well, is an exception. Waiting to see who you stop on, although I have an idea. Okay. She's yeah. a songstress from a famous opera company in the Empire. I'm not entirely sure what brought her to the Officers Academy. I love Dorothea. Yeah, I like her a lot. I think she was the one I, I uh, in my first playthrough. I would have romanced her, but I ended up romancing Edelgard because I was like, yes. well, I can romance Dorothea theoretically in any route but i can yeah. only romance edelgard right oh here. right yeah but see i yeah because i did the the church route because i missed yeah the you did the church time. route yeah so, like, so i didn't have yeah. that option so yeah, i yeah, literally yeah, yeah. the route i was playing was the only feasible way to romance edelgard so i was like yeah, yeah absolutely edelgard's like my second pick anyway i'll just go with her yeah and dorothy is like pretty easy to recruit from other routes as well uh generally speaking yeah i'm pretty so. sure i like immediately recruited her when i was playing blue lions <laughs> Please accept my apologies for the other day. You came to our aid, yet I hadn't even the courtesy to properly introduce myself. I am Dimitri Alexandra Blathed, Crown Prince of the Holy Kingdom of Fargus. I'm sorry, what? I am Dimitri hmm. Alexandra Blathed, Crown Prince of the Holy Kingdom of Fargus. I am Dimitri yeah. Alexandra Blathed, Crown Blathed? Prince of the Holy Kingdom Where's of the Fargus. Where's the TH in that last name, sir? I am Dimitri Alexandra Blathed. Blathed? Of course, at the academy. <laughs> I've never known. And I've heard word that you are to become a professor here. Like oh my! Reason, I still okay, have much wow. to learn, huh. but I'm confident I could benefit greatly. From I've never heard that way. In any case, welcome to the monastery. I hear you're investigating the different houses here. Did any of the blue lions catch your attention? Literally only Mercedes at first glance. Is the answer to this question, but also I'm a fan of Sylvain, Ingrid, and Felix now. Uh, I like Annette a lot as well. That's so. <laughs> I remember literally nothing about her, so I don't. Yeah. Uh, well, well, scored yeah. a teaching gig here, did you? <laughs> Talk about a great first impression. I guess that means I'd better introduce myself properly. I'm Claude von Regan. I'm from the ruling house of the Leicester Alliance, but don't worry too much about all that madness. Imagine if instead of Regan, it was Reagan. Yeah. Could you imagine the memes? <laughs> oh yeah, it'd be great. I'm guessing you don't know which class you'll be teaching yet, do you? I bet you'd like ours. We're not as difficult as the other two. Yeah, but one of the other two has Dorothea and Petra. Claude, I don't think you're looking at the big pinch, uh, picture here. <laughs> Have you met the folks from the Golden Deer House yet? Care to know more about anyone? I should probably look at the list just so I remember which characters are actually in it. Aw, oh, dude! No wonder I didn't do uh, Golden Deer my first run, even though I really like Claude's design. I forgot that I absolutely hate the way Lorenz, Raphael, and Ignatz all look. <laughs> all three Ooh, of them look like uh, complete failures to me. I, yeah, I don't like uh, Raphael's design. <sighs> Florence is just, a, I don't know. I, his look suits his personality. Um, I'm pretty sure that, like, from glance, I decided Lorenz was my most hated character in the game without knowing anything about him. Just when I saw what he looked like. Interesting. Uh, there, I think there's a lot of Lorenz fans out there. I I think he's, like, middle of the pack at the... 
Lysithia, Marianne, Hilda are all great, though. Leone, you know, we'll, we'll talk about her later. I don't remember if I like her I or not. I appreciate your uh, I think we had one conversation about her. I didn't think you did, and uh, I don't think I really do either. suppose I should return to Rhea. Yeah, return to the audience chamber. At some point, we have to get to actual gameplay in this place. <laughs> How are you enjoying your time at the Academy? Now nah, we just keep looking at characters. I hope you have found our halls brimming with the vitality of well-intentioned souls. Hmm. I suppose it is time for you to take charge of one of our three houses of students. Is there a reason you're like snorting in the middle of me listening to dialogue? Yeah, sorry, sorry. I must note that I am personally against entrusting someone as lacking in trackable history as yourself with such a task. But it is as the Archbishop desires. Do you ever notice that in a lot of games and anime and stuff, they, like, try and portray people like Sedeth as, like, oh, this guy is, he's obviously against you, so he's, like, an antagonist in some way, or, like, he's a force against you. But honestly, of the, like, five people in this room, the most reasonable one is Seteth? Yeah. I don't, yeah. I, I don't know if they, I guess they do kind of make him seem, like, against you, but, I, yeah, he's always come off as just, like, has reasonable concerns. Yeah, straight up. For the most part. The black eagles, the blue lions, and the golden deer. All so different. I hope you've made it a point to get to know each of them. Yeah, no one's told me the type triangle between the three of them. So, like, is it black eagle beats blue lion, <laughs> blue lion beats golden deer, golden deer beats bleak a uh, black eagle, or does it, like, go the other way? Like, someone um, want to explain it to me? Yeah, that's a good question. I don't see how lions don't just beat both like i don't know in terms of animals anyway lions definitely beat deer so i guess that means eagle has to beat lion just because like they claw him in the eyes or something and then fly up in yeah, the air and are like ha, 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 dumb idiot i'm not entirely sure how the and, deer's beating the eagle uh, but the deers uh only when fighting eagles they develop nature jetpacks and <laughs> can then combat them in the sky oh my gosh since you are new here we have decided to allow you first pick Manuela and I will take charge of the remaining two houses. Hanuman and Manuela are far too, like, understanding and willing to, like, <laughs> yeah. take the L for you. <laughs> yeah, like, oh, we don't care. You can just... Like, don't... Weren't they born in, like, a specific region over the other? Like, wouldn't they... What happens if you're not born in one of the three regions? Like, you're born in Garrig Mach? Like, how does that work? I don't know. Also, like, through the game, you can just, like, get other people into your class, right? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. even though each of the classes are clearly based on, like, what country you're <laughs> yeah. from, what are the yeah. immigration laws in this universe? <laughs> I want to know. Aw, oh, dude, I just want to, like, literally just looking at the lineup of characters, I'm like, just from design alone, I'm like, half of you I don't care for, like, two or three of you are cool, when I look at Golden Deer and Blue Lion, and then I look at Black Eagle, and I'm like, each and every one of these characters looks awesome. Like, they, they all look interesting. Like, how did you stack this house so much compared to the other two? But obviously, this is a this is a Golden Deer run, so we're doing Golden Deer house. Yeah. I will give you, at, at the very least, like, the, my main thing with the Golden Deer house is it has some of my absolute characters, and then it also just has some of my, like, least favorite, like, students, at least. Highs and lows. It's like, uh, it's like, like uh, Iron Man 3. Uh, yeah, basically, yeah. Absolutely. Nice. I don't know, dude. I just, I see Lorenz and Raphael. Like, Ignatz isn't as bad now that I'm looking at him a little bit more, but, like, I see the design of Lorenz and Raphael, and I'm like, I want nothing to do with either of these two people. Yeah, I'm, I'm not uh, a big fan well, of Leone's design either, mostly because she's next to three other, like, way better looking women. Yeah, well, I'm sure we'll talk more about Ignatz as the game goes on, um, but I love him a lot. I think he's the one that we're going to differ on our the most. Well, I mean, I, I literally know nothing about him. I don't think I ever interacted yeah, yeah, yeah. with him at all in Black Eagles or the first half of Blue Lions. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, I think I've recruited him in almost every playthrough I had, and the first time was kind of by accident, because he'll join based we'll, off authority, we'll I think. We'll definitely talk and, like, figure out who we want to recruit and all that, but I'm telling you right now, first thing that's happening is I'm recruiting Dorothea. <laughs> uh, that's fair. Your heart I'm trying to think how much uh, support conversations All Dorothy has with anybody. I can only really remember the one she has with Lawrence. With it doesn't matter because she, uh, she, she learns Meteor, and that's what I really care about. That's true. Uh, you basically have her or, like, Hanneman. I think they're the only ones. Wait, are there not mages in Golden Deer? Uh, not that learn ten range spells. Okay. I was about to say, Ignatz has to be a mage, right? Like, what else? He wears glasses. No, no, no he's what not. Does he do? What? What does he do? Uh... <laughs> 
he doesn't really have a well-defined role. I think his cannon class might actually be uh, some sort of thief or assassin, which doesn't make any sense. Um, he wears glasses. Or like mortal savant. Yeah, no. He is a nerd, but he's not a mage. All right, well, you know. Your heart has made its choice, then. All I ask is that you guide these open minds with virtue, care, and sincerity. Oh, dude, right, Lysithia is, like, yeah, known Lysithia for being a genius <laughs> mage, right? I was like, as soon as, like, Lysithia and Marianne, they're, they're both mages. <laughs> yeah, and Lysithia is, like, one of the most broken... Yeah, Lysithia, isn't Lysithia's magic stat? Like, eight game. other people's magic stats all stacked on top of each other? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They are all promising youths who bear the weight of Vodlin's future upon their shoulders. I hope you appreciate what an honor it is to lead them. I don't think I ever got to do any supports with her, but I know, like, Lysithia, as a gameplay standpoint, because in my Black Eagles run, when I had to, like, dominate the Leicester Alliance, which should not be called Leicester, it should be Leicester, if anything. <laughs> but when I had to dominate them, she was the only one that I beat up, and she was like, can I just be on your side? And I'm like, sure. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Brother? Oh, I am so sincerely sorry. I did not mean to interrupt. Flane, as like a 12 year old, just gets to walk into like the giant like archbishop room without knocking or like being introduced or anything. Like, there are guards at the front door. We've seen them. Do they not tell Flane, like, oh, sorry, they're like in a big meeting that's like really important? Small children not allowed? Uh, I don't know. I guess F Flane gets special privilege. I'm in the middle of For some reason. Though. Is it urgent? It's probably because her hair is green. Green haired people get all of the respect in this game. It's true. No, no, it's nothing. More importantly, who is this? This is our newest professor at the academy. Oh my! A new addition to the Officers Academy! I am so very pleased to meet you, Professor. I am Sedith's little sister, Flame. I am so happy to make your acquaintance. Let us focus on the topic at hand. There is something you should be aware of. In a few days' time, there will be a mock battle between the three houses, intended to gauge the current progress of the students. I'm sorry, when did we get into this business? Like, gauge what... what progress? <laughs> like, so there are, two, there are two possibilities here. We're already, like, halfway through the school year, and, like, they have progress to be gauged. In which case, what happened to the previous professor? I'd like to know yes. what caused him to suddenly leave his post, because I think it might not have been voluntarily. Second of all, if it's not, and this is the start of the school year, what on earth kind of progress are we gauging here? <laughs> we it's a great question. This battle as an opportunity to ascertain your own abilities as well. Please do not disappoint the Archbishop. That is all. Our new homeroom professor? Is that true? You aren't quite what I had pictured. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean that the way it sounded. Do I know Ignatz's voice? Uh, that's a great question. I don't know that I. Is that true? Recognize it. What's my picture? Oh, sorry. I didn't mean that the way it sounded. Is that true? You aren't quite what I had pictured. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean that the way it sounded. No, I don't think I do know his voice. Oh, I don't think you do. No. Is that true? For a second, You're I was like, it sounded kind of familiar, but no, I don't think oh, I do. Sorry. Uh, Wait. Nah, he's what? been in like five different things, and unless you're secretly a big fan of Mobile Suit Gundam, very two specific <laughs> theories. Chaos looks across the room to his life-size <laughs> Mobile Suit Gundam <laughs> model. Actually, and there's only two different series. It wasn't even any, like, old ones, actually. Yeah, no. It's actually, there's 14 different voices, and they're all the things that I assure you you've never watched, uh, especially not dubbed. What? Are you really our new homeroom professor? I also really don't think I know Hilda's voice. Uh, I don't think so either. I'll I'm see if she has sure any things as well. Don't tell me. You chose this class just to get to know me better, right? I'm flattered, really. Wait, oh, wait, uh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I was sure you'd be roped into joining the Knights. Did the, did the teachers not count as members of Knights of the Saros? Uh, no. I think they're, uh, different. 
What, did they got like an external contract or something? Yeah, the Knights of Saros have to go out and like do separate missions. All right, if you say so. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. So now that you're our professor, maybe I should choose my words more carefully. Yeah, Claude, maybe you should. That's going to be a D minus on your first report. Oh, well then, since we're pretty close in age and all, I suppose formalities aren't all that necessary. I pressed A way too fast, but I just want to, like, shout out to the game for the cojones to give me, like, the option menu to pop up with only one option to press. <laughs> one must truly marvel at the exceptionality of this appointment, becoming a teacher to students almost the same age as yourself. How unusual. Dude, I definitely know Lorenz's voice. Uh, one must uh, nothing really turned up for exceptionality of this appointment, becoming a teacher oh, to students mean? almost the same age as yourself. Sounds like something from How a unusual. Persona game. One must truly marvel at the exceptionality of this appointment, becoming a teacher to students almost the same age as yourself. How unusual! I can't pin it, but I I feel like I've definitely heard this voice <laughs> before. Well, Lorenz Lorenz's voice actor also he's voice acts Caspar, so that's fun. Oh, he's also Caspar. They just had a voice two different of game. What? I don't know. They don't Unusual. really sound the same. One must truly marvel at the exceptionality of this appointment, becoming a teacher. To Dude, this one's on the top the of this one's like on the tip of my tongue. I don't want to look at Unusual. chat, and I don't want you to tell me. I feel like I should know this one. One must truly marvel at the exceptionality of Lorenz, this appointment. I feel like I've got to know. I've got to be able to recognize this voice. It sounds How so unusual. familiar to me. At first, I thought it was someone from Persona, but then I'm like, no, because it's not Yusuke, because that was my first thought, but it's definitely not Yusuke. One must truly marvel uh, at the exceptionality of this appointment. Um, Becoming a teacher to students <laughs> almost the same age as yourself. How unusual. Uh, One must truly marvel at the exceptionality of this I'm looking, there's some things that Becoming a teacher maybe? to students oh. almost the same age as yourself. Huh, I don't know if you usually like Be quiet for a second, let me listen. One must truly marvel at the exceptionality of this appointment, becoming a teacher to students almost the same age. Oh my as goodness, dude, this is uh this is freaking um uh uh it's uh it's young Xehanort from Kingdom Hearts. I literally just scrolled past it and I was just like, oh I see something that holds exceptionality of this appointment. Yeah, this has gotta be young Xehanort. I can picture young Xehanort like saying How darkness unusual. in my head as I fight him in Remind. Uh, all right. Yeah, I'll look there's at, also I'll look some, like, Naruto video game voices, but I don't see it for voices for anybody in the anime. Well, maybe. What Naruto video game voices? Uh, for Sai. <laughs> it Sai. might, yeah, actually, oh. I think it is the same voice from the show. Yeah, I'm pretty sure all the Naruto games have the same voice actors from the show. That makes pretty. sense. I can hear it, but, yeah. I mean, Oh, Sai. he's also Rokuro <laughs> from Berseria. Rokuro from Tales of Berseria is the same voice actor as young Xehanort? I never realized. That's crazy. I've heard you are a skilled mercenary, but I cannot shake my discomfort at your new position. It's such a shame that such a good voice actor is, has to, like, voice the worst-looking character in the entire Fire Emblem franchise. <laughs> are you really as strong as they say? Let's see your biceps. I bet I packed on more muscle than you. I honestly have... I definitely could have known Raphael's voice, or I've never heard it before. No idea. I doubt that. Uh, Apparently, well, it's fine out. I never looked into his voice. ...by Alois, one of the knights. As far as skill goes, I saw it with my own eyes. What's more, teach uh, no. a child of the most He's done five different things ever. Nice. I heard. There's no way a child of the captain isn't worthy. It's simply not possible. Oh my goodness, I just remembered that Leone has the biggest heart on for our dad of all time. Yep. And I hate it. <laughs> yup. That's uh, one of her main uh, points of who she is. The captain? talking about i think i know lysithia too uh, that i'm not sure about who are you Let's talking see. about the captain who are you talking about the captain who are you talking about this also sounds very familiar riveting gameplay listen man you can either, <laughs> this, is, this is exciting you can, for us you, you can either have me play a fire emblem game or you can have me not play a fire emblem game make your pick the captain uh... who are you talking about Lorenz also did Bond's dub voice in Seven Deadly Sins? That's crazy. Oh, yeah, I did scroll past that. And the Captain? I don't really hear it. They, they sound different to me. The Captain? Who I don't remember Bond's about? English voice well at all because I watched it subbed. Uh... I only saw a little bit of dubbed. The Captain? Who are you talking about? Oh. I, I definitely think I know Lysithia's voice, but I couldn't tell you where I could place it from. 
Um. Geralt, of course. Hmm. The most notable captain of the Knights of Saros and a peerless mercenary. It's also entirely possible Conan that Conan kids next door, Invader Zim. Conan kids next door, and Invader Zim. What characters? I don't know. S Sonia and Lee. I don't know who those are. The Conan those kids next door characters should be numbers. Uh, number eighty-three and eighty-four. Eighty-three and eighty-four. That sounds vaguely familiar. I think that they were side okay. characters. Who, who uh... is she in Invader Zim? Uh, Sarah, Child 1, and Bad Actress. I'm assuming Sarah is the only one. Mm, Sarah doesn't sound familiar. Yeah, I don't think so. There was... I was about to was say... There was, like, one from, like, a Young Justice movie or a Teen Titans movie. Oh, dude, I probably know that. What what was that? Uh, the Teen Titans movie. Nyanya or, and Tomoko. I don't know. It's, like, 2006 movie. What's the movie called? Uh, Trouble in Tokyo. Oh, that's the Teen Titans, like, cartoon. Like, the famous one. It's its oh. movie conclusion. I definitely watched that, and I definitely would have recognized it but i was about to tell you absolutely like i could be recognizing lysithia's voice from my black eagles run where i got her at the end of the game <laughs> <laughs> that's very possible uh but no i definitely like invader zim codename kids next door i i watched the heck out of those so yeah that's cool passos and i'm like i don't know who's the main character it who's not which ones you've seen them. any Captain of that Gerald deserves nothing but respect Hmm. Well, after working as a mercenary alongside a father figure such as he, I have high hopes for our professor. Do you ever look at Lysithia and just think of a cat? Oh, uh, I can see it. I can see it. I don't know why, but as soon as her character art came up at the bottom right there, I was like, that's that's a cat. Like, just put cat ears on her. You may as well have. This is already, like, anime <laughs> waifu of the game. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm surprised they didn't do that. Just because someone is special doesn't mean their children are special too, Lysithia. Assuming that a child is going to be exceptional just because of their lineage is a bad idea. Did you watch Bleach in sub or dub? Lysithia's VA voiced Ishigo's sister Yuzu in the dub? That's a really good question. Did I watch oh. Bleach in sub or dub? I don't remember. <laughs> you don't know? I no, feel like I you watched it in sub, because I think I mentioned watching it in dub. And I I'm pretty sure I watched it didn't. in sub. I definitely... The answer to that question is entirely dependent on what RTK told me when I asked him if it had a good dub or not. I, I was always under the impression that I had a, a good dub, so that's why I started watching dub. Huh? Oh, um, yes. I suppose so. Marianne's voice is too quiet for me to even begin to guess if I know her voice or not. Well, we you can definitely know her voice. I can't I... wait to see what tactics you've learned from the captain. All right, no one in chat tell me. I'll uh, have to wait until she has, like, louder dialogue. Yeah, yeah. It might be a while until she talks more. But once she talks more, I think I think you can get it. Here, wait a minute. Let me see if I can get it off of this one. Like, I literally... It, I almost yeah, there's a, there, there's a, yeah, there's a spoiler in chat, so don't look at chat. I'm, yeah, I'm not looking at chat unless I want to know the answer to something. Huh? Oh, um, yes. I suppose so. Huh? Oh, um, yes. I suppose so.